When the web wallet is loaded in your web browser or in your app for the very first time, it will automatically generate a new wallet for you without any interaction. If you study the wallet view, you'll see that some of the lines are blurred out and some of them are clear. If they're clear, they're safe to share publicly, and if they are blurred out, that means that these are private and you don't want to share these because if you do, someone can take your money. However, the very first thing you should do is click on this I to show the mnemonic, these 12 words, it's known as a mnemonic, and you should write them down on a piece of paper because this is your money. Anyone who takes this uh, and gets a copy of it can take your money. And if you uh, clear your brow browser cache or drop your phone in the ocean, the only way to get your money back is to have these 12 words. So very first thing you should do is write these words down. The private key is used to also retrieve the money, and there's slightly different ways. Uh, as long as you have the 12 words, that's the most important thing. That's the only thing you really need to write down and keep safe. Under the wallet information is uh, additional details. If you just want to delete the wallet and create a brand new one, click the delete button and it will automatically generate a brand new wallet with a zero balance. If you have 12 words that you've written down from a previous wallet, you can paste them in this here, um, just like this. And click the import button and this will delete the current wallet and replace it with the new wallet that you just imported from the 12 words.